today we are making the three milk cake or it's known as stress leeches. Let me tell you the story behind it. So one day I was getting bored and scrolling through the reels when I found out this video. Let's go. So I took the tube to central London. I'm taking the central line to Tottenham Court Road. I really don't have to wait at all for the tube because it came in just one minute. And this is a London thing. If you have to wait for like less than one minute or less than two minutes, that's fine. But if you have to wait for four minutes for a tube, it's mayhem. Now I'm walking through the beautiful Tottenham Court Road tube station. I took this escalator out of the stadium, crossed many such restaurants like this one, 21 Soho, crossed many parks like this one. It was a very sunny day, many people enjoying the sun, I crossed many alleys and then finally I reached Leto. It's not hard to spot at all, it's on the main road, just two to three minutes walk from Tottenham Court Road station. Before going in, I did a bit of window shopping and this is what I saw. It's like a heaven for desert. They had varieties of cakes for varieties of flavors. You continue watching unless we find out the one for which we came, which is the three milk cake. And for now, let your eyes feed on the cakes. front this is the three milk cake for which we came it has original flavor it has kesar pista flavor like this one and original flavor again with strawberry on top and this is pistachio flavored three milk cake the decor was pretty and also pretty basic it was temperature controlled and there were many people also enjoying breakfast because they also do serve breakfast and lunch along with the beautiful desert i'm leaving in the menu here so that you can take a look at what they sell you can take a screenshot and zoom it Hey guys, so I got my cake from the Leto shop. Here's it is, all packed. And I'm gonna go home and unpack and taste it. So I went all the way to central London to Leto and get the most popular, recently viral, three milk cake. Now the three milk cake is also known as Tres Liches, but I would call it three milk cake because it's easy to say that. So I packed the cake in here and the packaging looks so nice. I mean, I, I'm, I'm in love with the Let's see how they packed it. So some tissues and here comes the cake. Nicely packed. It's still cold and I'm sure it's eaten a bit colder and not like room temperature cake. So that's how nice it looks. Let me show you a close. They've also given me a pair of cutlies, two spoons and the bill so of course it's eight pound 50 pence for the three milk cake so let this get it out on a plate and enjoy and see how it tastes and also let's see if i can replicate it so if you go by the looks of it three milk cake is basically the sponge base here which is very airy and soaked in three kinds of milk one is the condensed milk the evaporated milk and whole milk so let's bite into it it's really creamy very moist and completely soaked in milk i wouldn't say the sweet is too high it's moderate sweet lesser so put, to put in reference it's less sweet than a Cadbury dairy milk and it's topped with some fruits like strawberry and the blackberry and there are bits of milk in here which they have packed also 
हेलो वन वेलकम टू माई चैनल दिस इज मी समाजा आई टेस्ट एट द आलिया भट वायरल थ्री मिल्क केक फ्रॉम द लेटो कैफे एंड नाउ आई एम गन मेक द सेम थ्री मिल्क केक बट एट वन फोर्थ ऑफ द प्राइस सो द वन स्लाइस ऑफ केक वॉज एट पाउंड फिफ्टी पेंस आई एम गन मेक एट पोर्शन ऑफ द सेम केक एट द सेम प्राइस विद नो डिफरेंस इन टेस्ट So this is the Alia Bhatt's viral cake, which is the best three milk cake in London, according to her. And she flew it from London to Belgium during the shoot, so I had to try it. So after trying oops, this cake out, I got the ingredients here, and I'm going to try to make it at home. Now, first, let's go to the ingredients. First, I have the sponge mix here. Then, uh, I have to add two eggs to the sponge. So here is my egg. And now we need three types of milk. One is the evaporated milk. Next is the condensed milk. So I already had some condensed milk at home, and a cream for the topping. I also have whole milk in the fridge, which I'm gonna attach it here for the price. And to have a good decoration, I have got strawberries and M&Ms. Now this cake is around 8.5, but this total ingredients is again 8.5, and the quantity of the cake would be as big as this. We're gonna serve around eight people, so it's more economical. But let's now test the taste. So first, first let's take the vanilla sponge, icing berries. Here, uh, according to the instruction, we have to add two eggs, whisk it, and then add eight tsp of whole milk. So it's a 400 gram pouch, and I'm gonna empty the entire of it in my bowl. It's really easy to use the sponge mix because it has all the proportions. I don't have to like measure the flour, the baking powder, etc., etc., sugar, etc. So it has all the ingredients. I just have to take this. Oh, one egg is already broken. Never mind. I'm gonna use this. Why waste it? How come it's broken? It was the biggest in the lot. Maybe that's okay. Never mind. Take the second egg. Let's check if any other of them is broken. Otherwise, I'll use that. Doesn't look like it. So the second egg. Now it's time to add eight TSP tablespoon of milk. Now I don't have a tablespoon with me right now, so I'm just gonna measure it with the lid here. It more or less measures the same like a TSP of milk. One. Now just whisk it. Now take your container and line it with the baking paper which will help the cake not to stick on the base. I didn't use any butter because the baking paper does it for me but if you are not using baking paper then do apply butter otherwise the cake will stick at the bottom. Now the batter is ready. I'm going to put it in the oven and going to cook at 180 degree Fahrenheit for 18 to 20 minutes. And the cake is ready in no time but what would you do in this 20 minutes? You would prepare the milk. Now according to the recipe we need 2 cups of whole milk. I'm going to prepare my three milk mixture in this vase. It might get a bit messy, but never mind. I'll clean it later. Now half a can of condensed milk from this here. Then half a can of this evaporated milk. And then a pinch of Elmia double cream. Our sponge is also ready, but it's burning hot, so I'm gonna let it rest here a bit and cool. After that, we're gonna punch in holes and pour the milk in it. After mixing the milk, I'm gonna give this milk a bit of stir to get all the three different types of milk balance each other and give it a good taste. If you want, you can taste it as well to see the amount of sweetness and if you want your milk to be a bit sweeter than usual then you can add in more condensed milk so i emptied this bucket into the cake and 
I forgot to press the button. Never mind. So my cake is now soaked in the milk and I'm going to refrigerate it for the next three to four hours for the cake to completely soak in the milk. Our three milk cake is now ready, it looks exactly the same. This is our sponge vanilla cake soaked in three kinds of milk and topped with whipped cream and strawberries. So that means Sam's three milk cake number one and Leto Aliyavad's milk cake number two.